Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name's Ken. Today's experiment is the Velocity Races, investigating the flow of liquids. As always, adult supervision is required. What you need for this experiment is a plate, ketchup, mustard, honey, syrup, barbecue sauce, or any other kind of liquid. So before we start, we're going to make a prediction. So you guys have to predict what will flow down the plate faster, ketchup, syrup, honey, or mustard. So here we go, we're gonna set up our experiment. My plate's not big enough to do the barbecue sauce, so I'll be doing the syrup here. You just wanna put just a little bit on each one you do not want them to touch. Um, that will uh, kind of uh, cheat with the other one. So if one touches the other one, it probably will flow with whatever one's faster. So make sure there's a separation in there. There's ketchup. I made sure I shook up the ketchup and mustard bottles so it wasn't all liquidy. You wanna make sure you wanna Shake those up a little bit. So we got regular mustard there, and then we're going to do a little honey. Hopefully you made your prediction, and then we're going to see which one will flow faster. What you're going to do is tip the plate up until it starts to run, and then you're going to just hold the plate at that point. So we'll be able to have the races here and see which one will finish first. All right, starting off the experiment, lift the plate until one of the liquids start to move. And we can see right there, we'll stop. The corn syrup is starting to go down. It's taking the lead. And you can see on the far right, the honey is actually coming down second. So molasses, corn syrup, spaghetti sauce, most thick liquids pour slowly and stick to most everything, but they always flow. Ketchup is actually a very odd liquid. It doesn't come out very easily. But if we take the, a spoon and we tap it uh, on the plate, we can see what happens. There we go. We tap the plate a couple times. Tapping the plate sends a vibration through the ketchup, making it flow. And this is usually why you have to tap the ketchup bottle before it comes out. Now you can see the, the ketchup is actually caught up to the honey and it's moving down. It's probably not going to catch up to the syrup because that flows a little bit thinner. Uh, probably because it's light uh, syrup. I bet you if we had like not a light syrup, it probably wouldn't go as fast. The ketchup is definitely taken into second place. And even the tapping released the mustard. Uh, where most times squeezing it out of the bottle, mustard just comes out. Where the ketchup, you usually have to tap it to get it going. Pretty amazing because you thought the ketchup wasn't going to come. By tapping it, released the ketchup and the mustard. And so they're both moving. So even though the syrup won. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to click thumbs up or to share if you like this. And thanks for watching.